Giles Scott, it's a truncated day today, a technical problem with the chase boat. Not really safe to go sailing on T6 without all the chase boats on the water. Um, so let's talk a little bit about the, the wrap up for April. How are you feeling um, after a, a month of quite a lot of sailing, I think? Yeah, it has been exactly that. We've obviously not the not the best uh, best way to close it out today with a few uh, few technical issues there with the chase boat, but yeah, for sure we've we've got a, a lot of very good sailing days in over the last month, which has been been really great. And I think uh, you know the team as a whole has been progressing through through this last block. Um, and yeah, now it's time to to put the boat down for a for a, a little while and um, and look to bring it back out in a in a week or two. When you have a good day on the water, how do you know that's a good day? As sailors, you feel like it's it's been valuable, but do you know until you've spoken to the to, to the design team? Well, we ser we certainly know from from our side if it's a, if it's a good or bad day. Um, you know, from the sailing side, if the boat's operational, we're sailing it well, being you know putting decent manoeuvres down and sailing to, to targets and hitting the numbers well. Then you know it's all, all the all the normal all the normal measures. Um, of course, with a project like this, it's a little bit more complicated than that with varying levels of, you know, you've got the systems, electronics, uh, design have obviously got their, their, their hand in it as well. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's a, it really is a, you know, it's cliche, but it's a team effort and it goes across every department in the organization. So you've mentioned that you're going to put T6 away for a while. I guess she's not going to be um, just sitting in the shed. Are there going to be modifications, upgrades? Uh, yeah, there'll be a few, few, uh, a few upgrades, a few modifications. You'll have to wait and wait and see what it what it looks like when it rolls out next. And the AC40 will be back on duty next week. Yeah, we plan to sail that throughout the, the refit window. So yeah, we'll be uh, we'll be back out in the AC40 from uh, from next week at some point. Now, obviously, you can't do much testing with the AC40 in, in the way that you can do with T6. So what will be the focus for you? Will it be crew training, race training? Yeah, exactly that. We've, we've obviously got two, two events scheduled in now for, uh, for the AC40. So we've got to ultimately look, look at getting ourselves in, in shape for, for racing that yacht. Um, we've certainly been in a very development phase of, um, of the campaign. And you know, with, with racing, racing looming, looming, albeit in, uh, in the one design AC40s, it's, you know, we want to be able to put our best foot forward there. So yeah, getting out in the 40 next week and taking advantage of the, of the T6 down period is, is certainly on the cards. Looking forward to it. All right, thanks, thank you. Giles.